Flight Director is going to Huntington's going to take us through one more time for a Starship liftoff. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. We have the top. Vehicle is pitching downrange. And down from the top of the booster in the bottom left, and then a camera in the top flap of the ship looking back in the bottom right, so getting a couple of different looks as Starship heads uphill. We're separated. All of that exhaust gets plumed out the side of the hot stage. Ship ignition. Stage separation confirmed. Boost back burn start up. Acquisition is in Houston. Hot stage confirmed. Ship under its own power. Booster boosting back. Looks like all 13 are lit. Lots of excitement. So right here, this is <laughs> this is our view of the jettisoned hot stage. Uh, as we mentioned, this is a temporary fix to help uh, reduce the weight of the booster. Uh, so we have the super heavy booster. Future iterations will have a lighter weight integrated hot stage structure that won't need to be jettisoned. And we will be. We will be exciting, igniting 13 engines, and this is a great view on your left-hand side is a view, is three views from the booster and your right-hand side a view from the ship. And you can see those grid fins on your left-hand screen rotating and turning okay, to guide the booster, and there's that landing bird. That landing bird just begun, and you can see the water below. Ship has entered terminal guidance. That was absolutely incredible. The Expected first successful Houston. splashdown of the super heavy booster. Love seeing it just tip over <laughs> into the water <laughs> before losing that footage. But now we're going to start encountering increased pressures as the atmosphere gets thicker and thicker. Look at the the different areas. That, ooh, looks like we got the flap starting to come apart a little. Yeah, it does appear that we have a little bit of burn through there. We can see pieces of the vehicle flying off. What a show it has been. It's been like watching Interstellar or something. <laughs> This is wild to see this, but the ship is still coming down, which is incredible to see. How far can it go? <laughs> that is the question. Keep your eye on the altitude in the bottom right-hand corner. We're at 54 kilometers right now. Now, ultimately, the data is the payload today. We've been saying it multiple times. We're the, you know, our teams are, are sitting, uh, reviewing this data live, learning where the hot spots are. As you can see, there's an obvious <laughs> hot spot there with the flap. Um, and learning how we can improve this design. The goal was to get as far through this high, uh, this high heat re-entry as possible. Ideally, we'd love to make it all the way down and perform <laughs> that, uh, that landing burn and flip maneuver, but we may not get that far today. We will see. Got it is good news. And I may, I may have jinxed it. I apologize. <laughs> Look at that. It's back. We are still going. And and there we got that live view back. <laughs> the crowd very excited to see that view. Despite 
not being able to see very much. <laughs> the fact that it's there <laughs> tells us the ship is still alive. Yes. Passing through five kilometers altitude. This is incredible. We're getting very close to splashdown. These fireflies are such a good <laughs> sign of life right now. <laughs> we wish we could see more, but we'll take it. The starship is at two kilometers altitude, terminal velocity. Landing beam startup for Starship. All right, good news there. Landing board started. Starship is in landing board. Landing board shipping. The the landing board shutdown was commanded. Took place Starship made it through re-entry uh, and did its first ever landing burn. <laughs> that was incredible. Congratulations to our teammates, to everyone who supported the Starship program. Thanks to all of our future customers for your support. And we'd also like to thank the people of Cameron County, Texas, as well as the Coast Guard, the Federal Aviation Administration, and the government of Mexico. And since Starship got a little bit toasty from that extreme heat of reentry, and we've got our very own Starship right here, Let's have a toast of our own. I've been waiting all morning for this. Hey, <laughs> may I? Light me up. Yeah. Just like Starship, I like this toasty. <laughs> I'm keeping this.